Hello there, MATLAB user. I'm Alicia from Research Platform Services, and I'm doing my PhD in ocean engineering at the University of Melbourne. I use MATLAB to analyze my big satellite data of oceanic wave and wind speed. MATLAB is a practical tool to use to visualize my results for publication, like this one. As you can see, good visualization of your results is an important method to communicate your research. Therefore, I want to teach you about graphics object hierarchy in MATLAB. The knowledge about this will make you become MATLAB visualization masters. So what is graphics object hierarchy? It's very similar to Russian dolls. If you recall Russian dolls, you can see a hierarchy. The smallest doll, voice in the hierarchy, is nested in the larger doll in the hierarchy above. And then this doll is nested in another larger doll, and so on. So the biggest one is in the top of the hierarchy. First, you have a parent doll. This parent contains a child. And this child is a parent of this child. And this child is a parent of this child, and so on. In this case, you have the figure window in the top of the hierarchy, the axis object in the hierarchy below, and the plot object again in a lower hierarchy. That makes the figure object the parent of the axis object, and the axis object the parent of the plot object. In turn, the plot object is the child of the axis object, and the axis object is the child of the figure object. Now when you are aware of this relationship, you can assign each object to a handle to be able to change their properties in a smart way. If you don't know what a handle is, it is a unique identifier for each object, like the Twitter handle of NASA, which is called at NASA and is a unique identifier for NASA's Twitter profile. Now let's go back to MATLAB and see how we can use all of these to create master plots. So I mentioned that I'm studying the ocean and for that I'm looking at wave height distributions. Therefore, I will create one main plot of a typical wave height distribution and then zoom into the tail of the distribution in a second plot inside my main plot. How would this work? Well, I will use the graphics object hierarchy with the parent-children relationship and the object handles. I start with loading my wave data, then I create a figure window object and assign it to a handle f. Now I use this handle and the function axis to create an axis object in f with the handle x1. Then I plot a histogram of my data into this axis and assign it the plot to the handle h1. In the next step, I can use the handle h1 and the MATLAB dot notation to modify the face color of the histogram and set it to color black. Okay, I mentioned before that a plot is a children of an axis object, so when I obtain the children property of my axis using its handle, it should show me the histogram object. Now I use again the handle of my figure object and the function axis to create a second axis object in F with the handle x2. You can see that x2 is now overlaying x1. Therefore, I need to access its position property using its handle and modify its position and size. So here you can see the position of x2. The input indicates the left and bottom position, its width and height. Now I will modify the x2 position so that it functions as a smaller axis within the first axis. Right now x2 is activated and I plot the histogram of the tail data into this axis that helps me access the extremes. So now I would like to switch the plot of the tail data into the bigger axis and the plot of the whole data into the smaller axis because that's the best option for me to examine my data. So we learned that the parent of the plot object is axis. So I just need to switch the parent of the plot to get what I want. It goes like this. I access the parent of the first plot which is x1 and set it to x2. Now we have both plots on x2. After I access the parent of the second plot which is x2 and set it to x1. And now you could continue using handles and add additional feature to your plot to make it more readable. Now you might ask yourselves why I use Russian dolls in the beginning to explain the graphics object hierarchy. Well, they are known as wooden dolls with a secret. I have shared the secret with you so you know how to create master plots with MATLAB for publications. And here are some results produced by researchers who knew about the secret and work smarter, not harder.